Welcome to understanding the intricacies of the human brain, shaping attitudes and cultivating positive changes. The human brain is a marvel of complexity, comprising approximately 86 billion neurons interconnected by trillions of synapses. This intricate organ not only controls our bodily functions but also plays a pivotal role in shaping our attitudes and determining our perception of right and wrong. In this article, we will delve into the mechanisms of the human brain that govern our thought processes, explore why we develop certain attitudes, and discuss the brain's capacity for change and improvement. Attitudes are complex psychological constructs that influence our feelings, thoughts, and behaviors towards particular objects, people, or situations. The brain's limbic system, particularly the amygdala and hippocampus, plays a crucial role in processing emotions and forming memories associated with these emotions. When we encounter new information or experiences, the brain rapidly assesses them based on our existing beliefs and values. The amygdala, responsible for emotional responses, often guides our initial reactions, while the hippocampus stores these emotional memories. Over time, repeated exposure to certain stimuli solidifies these attitudes, creating neural pathways that reinforce our predispositions. The brain's prefrontal cortex, often referred to as the seat of executive functions, is vital in the evaluation of moral and ethical considerations. This region allows us to reason, make decisions, and regulate our impulses. When determining right from wrong, the prefrontal cortex integrates information from various brain areas, including the amygdala and hippocampus. Neurotransmitters, such as serotonin and dopamine, also influence moral decision-making. Imbalances in these chemicals can affect mood and, consequently, impact our ethical judgments. Understanding the interplay of these neural elements is crucial in comprehending why individuals may differ in their moral compass. The brain does not merely react to stimuli, it also possesses the remarkable ability to reflect upon and analyze its own actions. This metacognitive function is closely linked to the prefrontal cortex and allows us to consider the consequences of our behavior, fostering self-awareness and introspection. The brain's capacity for change, known as neuroplasticity, provides hope for individuals seeking to positively alter their attitudes and behaviors. Neuroplasticity enables the formation of new neural connections and the reorganization of existing ones in response to experience. Cognitive behavioral therapies leverage neuroplasticity to help individuals challenge and change negative thought patterns. By consciously engaging in positive behaviors and thought processes, individuals can reshape the neural pathways associated with their attitudes. Practices that enhance mindfulness and meditation have been shown to promote neuroplasticity, fostering a more positive outlook on life. Engaging in new and challenging activities stimulates the brain, encouraging the formation of new neural connections. Positive social interactions trigger the release of oxytocin, a neurotransmitter associated with bonding and trust. Cultivating healthy relationships can contribute to a more positive mindset. Breaking down larger goals into manageable tasks and celebrating small victories can positively reinforce the brain's reward system. In conclusion, the human brain's intricate architecture governs the formation of attitudes and the distinction between right and wrong. Understanding the interplay of emotional, cognitive, and moral circuits within the brain provides valuable insights into our thought processes. The brain's remarkable ability to change, adapt, and rewire itself through neuroplasticity offers hope for those seeking to positively transform their attitudes and behaviors. By embracing strategies that promote positive change, individuals can harness the power of their own minds to cultivate a more fulfilling and virtuous life. Thank you.